impressions on some new hair products for washing my hair my winter wash day um so i'll leave it up there for you guys so make sure you check it out if you haven't already make sure you give it a thumbs up and all that good stuff and give someone a thumbs up too because you know you're gonna like it you did it you did it now okay so yeah um this is my styling video version of my wash day or after my wash day whatever um, I am trying out three new products. It is a leave-in, an oil, and a conditioner. I mean, a cream. <laughs> but yeah, so let's, um, I guess, get styling our hair. I'll show you guys the three products that I'm using today. They are all cream of nature. Um, I'm using the cream of nature's argan oil from Morocco oil treatment as my oil. This is what it looks like. If it focuses... Oh, I think it is focused. Okay. <laughs> yeah, that's what it looks like. This, um, and then I'm using the Cream of Nature's Mango and Shea Butter Ultra Moisturizing Leave-In Conditioner for Dehydrated Hair. Um, this is what it looks like. Bada bing, bada boom. And then last but not least, I am using something I actually have been wanting to use for the longest, so I'm actually very happy they sent this to me. So yes, um... It is the Cream of Nature with Argan Oil from Morocco for Natural Hair Flexible Styling Snot. Bam. And that's what that looks like. And I have two of each product. So yeah, let's get started. Um, I think I'm going to be doing, um, like I know some people do like the lock method, like leave-in oil then cream. But I think I'm going to do oil, leave-in, then cream, like... I don't know. I don't know if it matters. If it matters, guys, let me know, like, which order I should do it in because I never honestly know. And, um, that would be great information for me to find out. But, yeah, let me know what you guys do down below. It will be very helpful. And if you have tips on what I should do, then let me know also. I would greatly appreciate it. But, like I said, I'm going to be doing oil, leave-in, and then cream today. So, um, let me open my oil and oh, spilling. So yeah, let me put this in my hair before it spills all over the place. And I'm only gonna be using one packet for my whole head. This oil is pretty thick. I'm not gonna be able to show you on camera because obviously it's gonna spill everywhere. <laughs> Can you guys see that? <laughs> okay, you guys see it. <laughs> oh my gosh <laughs> okay well it smells good first impression and then I also did say that it was very thick and as I'm putting this throughout my hair I'm feeling like maybe I do want to open the other one I don't really need to but do I want to I like oil, you know. I don't like my hair being dry. And you know, since I bleached it, like, <laughs> that happens very often. But whatever, it's cool. I'm actually gonna save that so I can have it for when I need it later on this week, probably. All right, so, get it everywhere. All right, guys. All right. All right, now that that is done, my oil is in my hair. Now we're going to put our leave-in in. 
And I have two of these and I think I am going to use both because, yeah. Mm. My hands are oily so I can't open it. Be right back. Those packages are really hard to open. But I went ahead and sectioned my hair into four sections because it would be easier for me to style it this way also. So yeah, I have two set, uh, two packets like I said. So I'm using the same as the shampoo and one packet per two sections. So let's get her done. Okay, first impressions, this smells amazing. And it is pretty, smells like, I don't know what it smells like, but it smells good. I do smell like the hint of mango. Yeah, it smells good. This is what it looks like. It's pretty thick, but not too thick, as you guys can see. So I really like that. I feel like it's definitely going to leave my hair moisturized. So, y'all. I do like how it feels on my hair so far. Just make sure you get it all everywhere. mess but yeah I'm going to do the rest of the sections and then I'll come back before I style it so I'm back the leave-in is in my hair um it is feeling very moisturized right now no lie like I feel like breeze like like it's just flowy airy I don't know how to explain it but it feels good I really like it um so yeah for the styling part now um, I hope this goes as planned. <laughs> um, but yeah, let's do this. I think I should wet my hair. I don't know. I don't know how I should do the snot, but I guess I just do it on the leave-in. We're gonna we're gonna go for it, guys. But I hope this goes as planned. Seriously, like I don't know how this is gonna work. Um, my only concern is if I'm going to have enough products for my whole head. Ooh. Okay, so it's very sticky. It's not very snotty as you would think. Like, if you guys have ever tried the uh, Gorilla Snot, that is definitely, like, snot. But this isn't, like, snot at all. This is, like, a really thick cream. Like, yeah, this is how it came out. But, um, can you guys see that? Like, it's, it's snotty, but not, like, snotty. Because, like I said, if you guys know... Um, so it's like a cream, like a thick cream. Like if you guys have used, like I said, the Gorilla Snot, that is definitely slimy, like, ugh. But, alright, I'm gonna put this through right here. Oh my gosh. Um. Um, yeah. Um, what do you guys think? I do feel like it controlled some of the frizz. I do see that. So I'm happy about that. Um, it's not that controlled, but 
and it's not very defined at all. I'm gonna finish the rest of my hair and I'm gonna come back for you guys. All right guys, so I'm back. This is what my hair is looking like. Um, show you guys the back. Has a lot of body and movement, which I really love about that. Um, it's very soft and airy and flowy, which I really like. Um, what I don't like is as you can see, like, I don't really care about frizziness, but it's very frizzy, poofy, fluffy. Um, I don't really have any definition. Like, if you guys, you know, if you're not new to my channel, you know what my curls look like. You know, you know, like I said, you know what my curls look like. And this isn't any definition. Like, it literally looks like I just got out of the shower from washing my hair. Like, when I wash my hair, like, it's like definition but frizzy poofy and that's what this looks like like my hair is more definite like defined when i wash it than this so i don't like that because i really like my curls and i like my curls to pop so i don't like that like it doesn't give me any definition i'm not sure what the styling snot is for if it's for just like slick back looks or what i don't know but Definitely not a wash and go type thing, at least not for me. I'm not having it. <laughs> like, it's not bad. Like, I obviously go out like this. Like, my hair is fine, but it's just not defined enough for me. It's not my cup of tea. So, final thoughts. Um, we're gonna do first the oil. The oil I did like. Um, it wasn't too thick. Was it too thin? I feel like it gave my hair a nice coating. So I do like that. I probably would purchase that. Um, the leave-in, I really do like that. I think that was like my favorite out of the three products. I definitely would purchase that one. Like it was a very good um, leave-in. Like it wasn't too thick, too thin. It gave my hair like a lot of moisture. It made it feel really good and hydrated and all that. So I definitely really do like the... Um, leave-in conditioner, so I definitely will purchase that. Um, and then for the styling snot, like I said, I've been wanting to try this product for a while, but maybe I didn't use it right, maybe it's not used for what I was using it for, but I'm just not feeling it. Like, my hair isn't giving me, like, the mm factor, you know, that I was looking for. I mean, I'm not mad at it, but it's just not great. Like, like I said, I don't know what it's used for. Maybe I used it wrong. If I used it wrong, let me know. How do you guys use it? Put it in the description box for me. Let me know how you use it. Um, but yeah, so those are my final thoughts, basically. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Make sure you give it a thumbs up and subscribe if you haven't already. And until my next video, guys, I love you. Mwah.